Hi everyone, this is Cow Terminator, and I'm sitting in for Ghetto Reel today. I'm going to be doing a short video on how to get the different types of warp drives. I'm going to assume that everyone's already crafted their first warp drive. I've already got a couple of them crafted right now. But what you do is when you're trying to build the upgrades for your starship, these emerald drives, the cadmium drives, most people will spend years in the same system, like a yellow system, trying to get emerald or trying to get cadmium. And those don't exist there. If you want to get the emerald, emerald and cadmium, you have to get... First, you have to get this cadmium drive, and all these things you have to buy the blueprints from the spaceports. So, go buy all the blueprints you need, use all the nanite clusters you need, make sure that you have the uh, terrain manipulator so you can collect the materials. And let's see, I only have one more I can craft right here the ceridium drive. Yeah, you cannot get emerald, you can't get cadmium, or any of that, or indium in. The yellow systems so what you do is after you build your first cadmium drive with I think it's 125 chromatic metal and five microprocessors you have to get out of the yellow systems you have to go and warp to a red star system so get out of these regular yellow systems we're looking for cadmium cadmium is red so we're gonna go to the red system all right out of here. I spent so many hours trying to find cadmium on the wrong planets or the wrong types of systems, but uh, you can see that when you scan these planets in the red systems, it's pretty common that they have cadmium in them already. So we'll go ahead and head to one of these planets see how hard it really is to get the cadmium refuel in mid-flight all right so cadmium should show up as just like copper should copper is yellow but uh, cadmium will show up just like those deposits except except red and am I still getting followed by these pirates Let's just see if we can find some just laying around. Alright, so for the video's sake, I'll just land real quick. Get out. Put my scanner on. Cadmium. That's how hard it is to find cadmium. Yeah, just make sure you build that first drive to be able to warp to the red systems. After that, it's the same process. You just repeat it over and over and over again. Collect the red material to get the red drive. There we go. Make sure you got that train manipulator. And I've already got this built, but you can see it's the same process for all of them. Sure, we charge that. The only one I've got left to do is the indium drive. So, the yellow systems allow you to go to the red systems. The red systems allow you to collect the red material to go to the green systems. The green systems allow you to collect the blue material to go to the blue systems. And that's the final one, is the blue drives. You could see color of the drive itself is actually purple and blue it just takes the green to get there they all take different technology modules and I believe the indium is the one that takes the most technology modules it goes like one two and three I believe but that's it for the video it's not too hard you guys just got to make sure to get out of the system get out of the yellow systems <laughs> make sure to get that chromatic metal you can go ahead and get chromatic metal by grabbing that copper portable refinery and you could just get out of here you make sure you go to the red systems then you go to the green systems and go to the blue systems 
and it's not really that hard. I'm surprised there's not many uh, videos on this. So I appreciate you guys watching. Check out uh, Get A Reel's other videos. Check out the live streams. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you all later.